So, you want to hear a story, huh? Come. I'll tell you everything you need to know. On a planet called Pandora, daring warriors called Vault Hunters scoured the borderlands in search of treasure and power. But they weren't the only ones. Handsome Jack, CEO of Hyperion Corporation, wanted the Vault and its secrets for himself. He and his robotic legions held the planet in an iron grip. The leader of the Vault Hunters was a brave man named Roland. He rallied an army of friends and warriors to fight Jack's tyranny. Closest to him was Tina, a young orphan explosives expert. She's a little... Uh, <laughs> look, she's completely banana sandwich, bonkers, crazy! Ah, there was a... There was Brick, who only thinks with his fists. Mordecai, a sniper who lost his beloved Bloodwing at the hands of Jack. Tor, more explosion than men. Ellie, a master mechanic. And finally, Lily, a siren gifted with incredible powers. However, she was not the only siren. Jack's daughter, Angel, used her powers to manipulate and betray the Vault Hunters. Though she turned on her father in the end, the damage was done. Jack was defeated, but at a heavy cost. Roland didn't live to see the victory his friends had earned. Sometimes, a hero's reward is little more than a gunshot to the back at the hands of a coward. The ones Roland left behind still had much to do. But one little girl had some ideas for a story of her own. Once upon a time, the Vault Hunters play the game. The world is on the brink of going boom boom. This is our most desperate hour. Unless we make a stand here and now, we're gonna die. Now. Roll for initiative! What's initiative? It says which order we attack in. I punch the initiative. What's going on? I wasn't paying attention. <sighs> Tina, why don't you start over? Ahem. <clears throat> Welcome, fine ladies, to your first session of the most coolest game in the world, Bunkers and Badasses! As your Bunker Master, I will be spinning today's tale of fantasy and- Wait, why the hell are we playing this kid's game? Oh, you know, maybe because- Shut the hell up, Morty! Tina! She's right, though. Shut up. While our vault hunting buddies beat the slam jam out of that Hyperion informant downstairs, I thought we could play a game. Now, pick your characters. You got the Necromancer, the Commando, the Siren- Siren. Dibs. My siren's name is Brick, and she is the prettiest. Tina, why don't we just start now and figure that out later? Come on, girl, you know we gotta wait for Roland before we start. Tina, Roland's... You know Roland's not coming, right? He's not... here anymore. Yeah, he's probably running late or something. We'll just start now. So, like I said... Roll for initiative, sucker! You arrive at the docks of Flame Rock Refuge. This place used to be really nice, until the handsome sorcerer messed everything up. I say we head toward the town to investigate. Lovely day in Flame Rock Refuge, a far cry from- Wait, didn't you just say the sorcerer messed up the town? Why would things be lovely? Uh, whoops. Uh, what I meant to say is, it's eternal night, and you hear spooky music, and the whole area kind of smells like butts and dead people. Um, I smell butts and dead people. Suddenly, 
you're attacked by a horde of skellymans. They start shooting at you! You get close to the entrance to Flame Rock Refuge, but suddenly... The handsome sorcerer's pet dragon appears! Surprise attack! Ho oh, oh, ho, I wanna smack it. You try to attack the dragon, but your attacks do nothing! The dragon attacks and... <laughs> Critical hit! Great, are we done now? Tina, uh, you can't start your campaign with a boss fight. Players can't win. Mmm, touche. Okay, everybody back up! Hey, idiot! I wanted to kill something. Okay, how about a new boss? He's a skeleton. And his name is... Mr. <laughs> Bony Pants Guy? Mr. Bony Pants Guy! Does that work? This pleases me. The road to Flame Rock Refuge is open! You should go there. Go, go, go.
You've entered the town of Flame Rock Refuge. In the distance, you see the town's scouting blimps, always alert in case of battles and stuff. What you gonna do now? Stop playing this game. Let's talk to some town folk. A grand idea. Missing! Maybe her bodyguard Eleanor knows where she went. The queen doesn't return. We shall never see the sun again! Sounds like we should go find this Eleanor. My kingdom for a god. Uh, the bodyguard isn't here. <gasps> oh, whoops. Forgot to put her piece on the board. Blam! Girl looks like she got a problem. I punch her problems. I talk to her. In character, of course. <clears throat> que pasa? The queen is missing! She went into the forest to bring the light back to the world! So where'd she go? She said something about using the tree of life to undo the curse. That must be where she's going. And so your purpose became clear. You gotta go to the forest Thanks, and help the queen. since the world went dark, but the gatekeeper's a real pushover. Just tell him I sent you. The queen went into the forest. It's too dangerous to go alone. I shall accompany you. Just one second, then. Whoop, time out. I gotta take this. This Tina. It's Mr. Torn! Tina! Put me in the game! Okay! The gatekeeper is now Mr. Torg. Woo! Rafael! I had to say you! So I'm a gatekeeper, huh? In that case. You gotta prove your bad attitude to get past me. First task, blow up the village's scouting blimps with the fire weapon. Because reasons! My back muscles are so ripped, you don't even know!
Challenge's only way to see approaching threats. We had no reason to do that. Fantasy! All right, that ass task too. Go to the Time Tavern. Yeah, I hit you, but I ain't sorry. Yeah. Have a tavern. Okay, you're at the tavern. <laughs> the bar owner has a problem. Talk to her. Hey, baby, I'm hung like a vault monster. Hey, adventurer, it's closing time, but these idiots can't take a hint. Could you throw them out for me? Don't be afraid to get rough. Moxie, yeah! surprise me. Oh, oh, come on, yeah. alright, I'm, I'm, I'm sorry. I'll never see nothing douchey again, I promise. <gasps> Bitch! That is unacceptable! They say Take him so down! Please. Punch him so hard he explodes! Adventurer! Torg is ruining your campaign. I'm having fun. Well done. You're now badass enough to survive the forest. Of our way. All right, fair enough. Okay, Mr. Torg, I banish you to the stocks. The stocks? Awesome! Anyway, I'm called Davlin the Gatekeeper. I shall open the way to the forest. You will not survive the horrors of the forest on your own. I shall move you inside and serve as a guide. Enter the Forest of Tranquility! Tranquility? Boring! Hmm. Okay, good point. <laughs> Dang, now I gotta come up with a better name for the forest. Can I interest you in some magic? 
magic bullets? You need healing. Badly. on the ground. Maybe the queen Ooh. left it to mark the trail. Then we should follow the jewels that lead us right to her. Yeah, what Big Lily style said. Just stick to the main road and you'll be ace. This forest grew from the corpses of my enemies. Isn't that a kick in the ass? Hey, maybe after I kill you, a fern will grow out of your body or something. People like ferns. You ever notice that?
find the right pod. Like you can throw grenades and hold it on targets, or spew flame, or split into a bazillion tiny grenades. They're badass. Follow me. I believe the queen went this away. Curses. A dead end. There must be some way through. This is orcish writing. It says you need to bathe the artifacts in the juices of blah blah blah. Whatever. Looks like you just need to collect some blood fruit. What the hell? What's a blood fruit? It's a squishy thing that grows on the trees over here!
threw on the tree ants. Think you're cool enough to grab the fruit without killing the tree first? what happened to Bloodwing. Mm, mm. So anyway, she's so cute! Where is she? Let's just play the Welcome game, Welcome to right? Cleric Zed's Health Emporium. Every part of that sentence. Thanks for the tip, amigo. Today is the day of the sunshine of the people! I'll take you to the night! I'll take you to the night! I'll take you to the night! I'll take you to the night!
Here. We should probably just take a break until Roland shows up. Stop it. Roland's not... Oh, I got an idea, I got an idea. The gatekeeper says... More orcish scrawls. It reads, Retrieve the White Knight, for only he can open the way. And I know just where he is. Waypoint! <laughs> 